What is the science of literacy and what is the literacy not? As educators, we believe in structured literacy and the importance of the science of reading. We are all familiar with Scarborough's reading rope and accept it as fact. We also know about Sedita's writing rope, which offers valid information. Separately, they provide potent reminders of the components of teaching reading and writing respectively. Together, however, they create a better picture of literacy. All research points to the fact that reading and writing are indelibly tied together and require the same pathways in the brain. Therefore, we at BrainSpring propose that the science of reading is more accurately termed the science of literacy, and the more relevant pictorial depiction is a literacy knot. BrainSpring's Literacy Knot ties together the components of reading and writing and shows the critical importance of teaching them concurrently. Reading and writing are not isolated skills, but rather the foundation for understanding content and the world around us. Let's take a few minutes to examine the two components of the Literacy Knot, analytics and automaticity. So what are reading and writing analytics? They consist of these five main categories. First, background knowledge allows the brain to build connections. New ideas must attach to previous information for better reading comprehension and richer written expression. Second, vocabulary expands what the students can understand and helps them express thoughts clearly and concisely. We know that daily exposure to content area text is an effective way to build vocabulary. Third, language structures enable students to determine and create meaning effectively. Along with grammar, direct instruction in syntax and semantics must be connected to text for comprehension and expression. Fourth, verbal reasoning refers to understanding concepts framed in words using creative methods like visualizing and questioning, rather than just simple word recognition. This helps to increase the depth of understanding. And finally, fifth, literacy knowledge is the understanding of the conventions of language, books, and text. These organizational writing strategies help students understand how the author puts text together and the purpose behind writing. The automaticity rope joins the analytics rope to form a knot. Reading automaticity can only occur when the sound symbol relationship is undergirded by three things. First, phonological awareness is the ability to identify the sounds in spoken words, and it is critical to achieving reading success. Second, decoding is the ability to fluently connect the sounds in words to the letters that represent those sounds. And third, we achieve sight recognition when words are orthographically mapped in our brain and move from short-term memory to long-term memory. The goal is to recognize words immediately upon sight, one seventeenth of a second. Writing automaticity is equally important so that students can attend to higher level skills as they write instead of focusing on first, handwriting, the process of forming the letters, second, encoding, the process of spelling words by correctly connecting written symbols to sounds, and third, sentence boundaries, which are the grammatical conventions of the language. Fortifying these ropes for an even stronger tie is oral language and content area connections. These strands weave in and out of the reading and writing ropes, further reinforcing their strength. Oral language forms the pathways for reading and writing. Written language, decoding and encoding, stems from the oral pathway in the brain. The ability to express oneself in writing depends upon the ability to form thoughts with spoken language. Finally, we know we don't just read and write during our ELA block. We read and write across the curriculum and across content areas. So, as writing automaticity and analytics converge, so do reading automaticity and analytics. These two interwoven ropes form a knot that cinches literacy together. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about the interdependence of reading and writing, and for committing yourselves to student success through understanding and building the science of literacy.